family. Oh, oh, besides my family, besides my wife and my children, my offspring, uh, kids I have out there. <laughs> Other people uh, that you know of. Uh, a good, some good grind. I don't like shitty food. I grew up with shitty, <laughs> shitty food. My mom used to make sandwiches, <laughs> and they they would be consisted of homemade bread that would be made with wheat, of course, as a base. But they would have spaghetti and mush in there as well. <laughs> And they would the mail she never them. Yeah, yeah, no, and then they would cut these, she, my mom would cut these slices, but they would be this thick on the top and they would taper down to like this thin at the bottom. And then she would mash them fuckers together. No, no, no. Oh, the grass clippings in. No, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so they would, she, she did, this was the sequence. She cut the bread unevenly. This bread was so thick, it kicked Metamucil out the window. You didn't need anything to help your bowel movements. You take this mayonnaise that had been sitting out. It had it had like a pudding skin on the top. But you dip into that mayonnaise jar, swab a couple times. You could smell the mayonnaise, but you couldn't see it. And she scraped the leavings back, crumbs on the knife, back in the jar. And then she would take this Carl Buddick beef, you know, the kind that you can see the light through. Like beef. This is beef. They use that for windows. Transparency. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Then she would to make sure there was not two slices of Carl Buddy. Uh, you can see through five of them. So. And she'd, bling, the bread's this big, the Carl Buddy's like, like an ABA. yay. And then uh, a little spritz of mustard. It's like this, real quick. And then maybe some brown lettuce to help with digestion. And then that was my, that was my sandwich. So I love, good food is important. Family is by far the best, more important thing, but, but good grub is apex to survival.